Okay, hello guys. Um, today I'm gonna be making a um, a water bottle holder. Actually, this is not the actual bottle that I needed, but it kind of like similar to the size that I'm I'm gonna be working with. It's actually just the um, hydro flask, 40 ounce. This is not the hydro flask. It's kind of like similar to size. So I I need my power cord, a lighter, a buckle, plastic buckle. I need this. This is like a key, I guess, key ring holder. And we might need if I do. So, yeah, so we might need some of this too. So let's get started. Actually, my measurement normally, because I'm going to use two different colors. I wanted, my niece wanted black, but I ran out of black. So I'll just use whatever I have. Okay, this is the power cord. What I normally do, I'm not tall. I am only a 5'2 person. So I try to make it maybe my height. I'm a 5'2, so I add another maybe three inches or five five fifty five okay so on that we're gonna need sorry guys so for that color we need two of that 53 that i measured so where's my hand we're gonna need two we're gonna cut that through burn the end so you won't fail see how we burn it so it will seal for you Be careful because it's hot, guys. And then the other end, the same thing. Burn that. And then burn that one. Okay. So basically, it's going to look like this. This is just a sample. It's going to look like, I mean, it's, it's going to be like this. But I'm going to make it longer because I want it to fit a, um, 40, in, 40 ounce. I think on this size that I have is for maybe 18 ounce or maybe less 12 ounce. So okay, let's let's assemble it together. You can see now I grab this one, the ring. I loop it through. Okay. Goes like that. And then we get the other color. We loop it through. So I did it. Put it in. Grab it. Pull it, and then we grab the other. Where's my other one? Let me drop it. Grab the other color. Loop it through. Going it in. Okay. Then our last one. Get this one. Put it in. There. See that? So now you have four. Okay, so this is how we make the pattern. We grab each color and then we go this way and then go underneath and then loop it through and it will look like this. Did you guys see that? Let's go do another one, okay? So when when we're done later on we have to make sure that they all they're all in the same Okay, guys. Okay. So I grab each color. Go this way. Grab the other one. Loop it through. Then boom. That's all it is to it. And make it tight. Work around it. And then later on, we can always check the measurement. Okay? So we, we'll do this until we cover the whole bottle. Okay? Go that way. Grab the other one. Go underneath. Loop it through. And the next one, grab it, that, then loop it through. There you go. That's how it is to it. So now what I normally do is double check if they all if they all are the same length seems like they are so I'm gonna just keep on moving
keep on doing it until I get through the size of the through the size that I need. Okay, let's. So, okay guys, I did it to the length that I wanted. So, um, let me put the bottle. It looks like this. It looks like that. But I want to end it by using this buckle and grab them and insert them on the that side. We're going to try and probably burn them when we're done. So it'll be sealed. and have one more so all four of them has to loop through this upper part of the um, buckle the clip not quite easy to put everything in that small tiny hole so I'm gonna try let's see you know as you get old your eyesight gets bad too you guys know I'm 46 and yes I did it I sight is getting bad so we have it that way so now we're gonna go down a little bit then we're gonna pull it like that so now we're gonna do the basic power cord braiding I would like to use this color cut a little bit enough to just make this look true so what we're gonna do is just do the basic power cord um, knots yeah i don't know what they call it but it's basically just dang, it's so hard to show so it's basically just the basic go this way that way a little longer muscles upper body okay I think we can do one more I got kind of short but yeah we can we can do one more we can do this okay we're done in one end cut that part right there try to burn it we're gonna seal it now okay see how I'm gonna be burning it I'm sealing it I get my scissor and flatten it out okay if you're not satisfied you go back hit it up again scissor and flatten it out. It should look like that. You can see it? There. Okay, now let's burn the other end. Burn it. You're gonna flatten that out by using your scissor because it's hot. If you do it with your hand, you're gonna burn your skin, bro. Okay. There you go. So now we have this extra ones hanging in here. You want that off. So we're gonna cut it off. Just like that. See, it's all gone. Now we gotta burn that too to seal them. Okay, and then we go there and flatten it out. And it's sealed. See it? Sealed, baby. Okay, so, this is how we're gonna end this. Let's grab. We gotta have enough. For this one because a little bit longer i don't measure really on this part so like how we did it on this one is how we're gonna do it on this side but since it's gonna be different because we have these extra ones in here so we'll go like this and loop it through
Let me end the clip. So that's how I'm doing it right now. This is the back part. This is the front part. Right here. But I'm just showing you guys the back part, how it looks right now. Because whatever pattern I'm doing in the back is the same pattern that I'm doing in the, in the front. So. The only thing with working with the power cord is that it makes your skin dry because there's a lot of pulling and tagging. How my skin is, it gets dry. I hardly, I hardly do this nowadays. Before it was crazy. I have orders left and right. Okay, I'm tired. So now let's show it with the um, bottle. That's how it looks, guys. See that? And that's the ring right there, or the key holder that we have. So that's the pattern. And there you have it. I did this really quick. I normally take a little longer because I want to make time, make sure everything is measured correctly. But pretty much it's, it turned out good. I mean, I don't even need to adjust anything. Mind you, I didn't do this for almost a year, or maybe a, a year now. So that's how it looks. I'm going to take it out and pull it. And do it. Keep it on, put it back, drink your water, close it. You can hang it on the stroller, you can hang it anywhere because it's, you can undo the clip to hang it anywhere. You can go to a basketball game, a football game, a baseball game, soccer game, easy. Easy for you to hold it and just let it hang someplace. Or you can just let it stay on your side. Normally it will stand straight, but this is a different type of bottle, but you can just leave it like that. There you have it, guys. I hope you guys like this video. I know it's quite long, but I hope you guys watch it and learn from it and make your own water bottle out of power cord. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe my channel. And thank you again for watching. Aloha. Mahalo.